the Tweedles are pretty menacing, but they're not evil. Like, I mean, they shot us with buckshot. Come on. That's why I was so mad at first. I thought that they, like, were actually shooting. Anyway. Wait, oh, sorry. Shit, what was the room number? I wasn't even paying attention. 1903. What? Why is the door open? That's a good question. Anyone in there? Okay. Crane? Of course he's not in here, dude. Wait! Uh, excuse me? This is timed? This is timed. Damn it. You must have missed him. There's gotta be no, it can't be timed. His witch here. It can't be timed. That's not possible. It's gotta, there's gotta be, uh, checkpoints Same or something. Found in the open arms. It's too much pressure. I don't like timed shit. Here, play it. I don't have time to look at it. in the old days. Great. Hmm. It's a headless horseman. But you're just gonna okay. Hmm. What's in here? Find something, Big B. Look at the notes. My dearest Snow, I know you must be aware of my feelings towards you. Watching you work. Oh, shit. I'm able to control myself. It's because I love you. <sighs> yeah, I'd rather be reading that stuff than Bluebeard. But look at that portrait in the background. Oh, man. This is all I could get. I'm afraid Snow will start to notice. I'll have the rest for you next week. Ichabod Crane. What? Was he paying? Here? What's he paying the crooked man for? Here, we'll leave them. I'm not gonna take the. I'm not gonna confiscate the money. We'll take the key, though. Seems like a good lead. It might be useful. Well, it's not a lead, but it's some something could lead to something. Doors lead to things. It's not a stupid thing to say. Okay. I'm getting defensive. I've Look at the picture. I'm that excited. Guess things have changed. Yeah, maybe he's not Crane. Maybe he's Math, got glamour on. History. If I had to guess. What? This shit didn't work. Uh, I don't want to think about it. What? Great. Holy shit. I haven't seen the time go down in a while. Ugh, good. I don't like timed things. Really? I think it was just... Yeah, I know, dude. He has, he's got a bust of himself in here. What the hell? Look in the box. Or not. Oh. Let's use the key. This is a nice place, man. What? Hey, stay where you are. <gasps> I, uh, Jack. Wow, it is just unbelievable running into you here. I mean, of all the places. This weather, right? A little damp, I guess. But, you know, some people like that sort of thing. You know, I've always wondered, do you get that wet dog smell when it rains? Like, do you have to wear a poncho? Explain yourself. Now! Okay, okay, okay. I know what it looks like, but before you go jump into conclusions, Crane pays me to water his plants when he's gone. What? Stipend, but you know I need the work. 
I wouldn't do it for free, right? You know me. So, anyways, uh, now that I'm done... I don't see any plants. Hey! You fucker! <laughs> okay! <laughs> you got me. Just... I don't like you. You better tell me why you're really here. Okay, okay. I heard Out Drake with it, Jack. Down. I figured he owed us little people a parting gift. Or just me a parting gift. You heard? I have my sources, okay? You see how he lives. He doesn't need any of this shit. A little Robin Hooding never hurt anyone, right? And you heard this from? What does it matter? I hear things. <sighs> what else do you want me to say? I got bills to pay. Not like Crane's gonna use any of this stuff. All right? Did somebody send you and tell the truth? No, it's just me. Just take it easy. Hmm. Don't show your injury. You no, know, this tortured, lonely pig eater bit's gonna get old eventually. Don't you get tired what? of it? I mean, what are you even doing here? Are you just wandering around Crane's apartment? What's the point? I'm investigating. Sure. Yeah. Well, looks like you've got it covered. Anyway, it was really nice catching up with you. I mean that. No, you don't. Bigby, I believe you're uh, blocking the doorway there. If I could just uh, squeeze through. God, you're so annoying. You know, on second thought, it's actually funny I ran into you like this. I think I can help you out. I may not know why you're here, but... I'm listening. Go on. I'm listening. Look, I have some dirt on Crane you might be interested in. Word on the street says he's got a witch in the city. I yes, can tell wi you who she is. If Thank you're God. Information comes at a price, though. But I'm sure you already knew that. How convenient. Convenient for you, Sheriff. I got the info you need. This is an easy win. Let's make ourselves a deal. I tell you about Crane's witch, and you forget you saw me here. One hand washes the other sort of thing. Wipe All the right. whole incident under the rug. Come on. Fine. Say? Fine. All right. You I'll do it. Deal. Perfect. Now tell me where I can find this witch. Strong grip. Her name is Auntie Greenleaf. Crane's been trying to keep it under wraps for years. I'm not sure what he's using her for, but if he's not going to the 13th floor, it's gotta be something illegal. How reliable is this information? Are you sure you have the right name? Absolutely, without a doubt. Uh, th the thing is, I don't know where you'd find her. Oh! You gotta be fucking kidding me. But even a name is a good start, right? I mean, that's more than what you came in with. It is. Right. I'll keep my eyes open for you. If I find anything else you might be interested in, I'll be sure to let you know. I think this arrangement can be beneficial to both of us down the line. How How is it beneficial for you? <sighs> it was just lovely running into you, baby. Wait a second. Oh, what does he have in there? Oh, come on. I didn't even look. Glamour tube. The white deer. Do you always talk to yourself like that? The witch uses the white deer on everything. It's her symbol or trademark, I guess. Figured I could sell these at the Lucky Pawn. The Lucky Pawn? It's one of the crooked man's places. I work there uh -huh. when I need some stability. It's a pawn shop. Get it? No, I get it. You find any more of these? Uh, no. You seem nervous. Want to try that again? Want to try that again? That it? Pick me. Are you still We're done, here? done, Jack. We're done here. Fine by me. Who are you talking to? What's he doing here? Evening, Miss White. Good evening. What's going on? He's, He's helping me. Jack had some information about Crane's witch. 
Oh, what did you find out? Her name is Greenleaf. Anti Greenleaf. But he doesn't know where we can find her. Great. Crane's meeting her at 2 a.m. And Snow, I found a note with some money attached. Crane has been embezzling from Fable Town. Uh oh. Of course, because why half ass being a complete sleazeball? Do you think this is tied to the murders? I mean, I guess it doesn't matter yet. Let's just catch him first. Find him. Right now, I honestly don't care. I just want to get the fucking guy. Crane's meeting Greenleaf at 2 a.m. And we have no idea where she is. We're going to cut it close as it is. We have to figure uh, out where he's meeting her. Wouldn't she be listed in the business office? I've had Buffkin searching for any unauthorized witches, but so far we haven't found oh, anything. Oh, right, of course. Name, but we don't have time to wait around. You should try Damn it. Holly's. She still has all of Lily's things. If she hasn't burned it already. There's still Tweedledee's place. We know they're involved. Bluebeard's and over there right now. Bluebeard went. Where do you want to go? We don't have much I time. I should probably go to Lily's. Because... Uh, we can catch up with Bluebeard later. We need to cover as much ground as quickly as possible. What are you looking at her like that for? Shut up, Jack! I'll go to the trip trap. See about Lily's things. I think that's, that's gonna our be best tough. option. It's Sounds gonna be good. tough. I'll give getting those out of her. Find something in the records. Let me know what he comes up with. I'll be in touch. I hope you'll do the same. We'll catch him, Snow. Hang on, Jack. I want to talk to you. Uh oh. Well, maybe Jack won't sell me out to snow. Hopefully not. Oh, it's one fifteen already. <laughs> oh, due to bereavement. She's asleep, you fucking idiot. She didn't even give me a chance to explain. What's left to explain? Just. You know what happened. We know what happened. Or how it happened. Why would she want to hear that? Well, can I... Can you what? Can I just... I don't know. Wait Hello! Is it Gren and the Woodsman? We're closed. I need to talk to Holly. Hey, look, Woody, it's the sheriff. Well, come on in, buddy. I don't understand. Brent, what? He's a traveler. A weary traveler in search of some hospitality, right? Right? I mean, you must not be feeling too good after that shit show. Just what in the fuck is wrong with you? Nothing's wrong with me. In fact, I'm in a good goddamn mood. You're drunk. Mood, so you should take advantage. I'm not gonna take advantage of you while you're drunk. Sorry, Kren. I'm not too keen on that proposal. But thanks for the offer. I want a drink. Anybody else want a drink? Kren, Swinehart said you shouldn't mix you it You think I give a fuck what that fucking guy says? Or what oh, you shit. say? Oh, shit. Grant, really, you shouldn't drink right now. I can't hear you when you mumble. Swinehart told me that Holly was here. I need to talk to her. Holly's asleep in back, but you won't be able to wake her. Really? Hmm. The doc gave him both barmesidal ambrosia for the pain. Look, the deal is, if you resist going to sleep like I am right now, it gives you a very, very, very nice. I see. Pop. I see what you're on. And he said that he shouldn't mix it he, with alcohol. That's a very bad idea. He's right. Yes, he did. He certainly did. But let me tell you something. I haven't felt this good in a long time, fat boy. And I feel like having a drink, okay? Have you seen her sister's things? What wasn't burned at the funeral? I saw her come in with something, but I didn't see where she put it. Nope, haven't seen it. Well, that's a dumb thing to do. That funeral back there? That was a shitty fucking send-off for a pretty okay lady. 
Yeah. You weren't fucking there. I'm talking to Bigby now, okay? Can't say you being there helped things much. So, Gren, don't start nothing. Who's starting anything? I'm not. You think I shot up the place? It wasn't my fault. They got away though, didn't they? Well, yes. Whatever. It's all right. I'm too out of it to get into it. I want to clear the air. We're all in this dung heap of a fucking shit town together. We're all going to have a toast. All of us. Fellas, I'm here for one thing. To look through Lily's belongings and get out of here. Now, yeah, right? yeah, I know, I know. And I want to help you, okay? And I will. The first... <sighs> I don't want to enable this. Take two seconds. As a show of good faith. And after, we'll all hunt and peck for Lily's shit or whatever. Grand Bigby didn't come here to get loaded with you. I don't want to get loaded with him. It's just a quick slug. I'm not gonna hurt anybody. And then I'm not gonna do I'll this. Help you out with your thing. I'm running out of time, Gren. Sorry. Gren, the doc said you needed to rest. How many times you fucking gonna warn me about it, huh? You're not my fucking mother, so just get off my back. I said I was sorry, all right? I can't do anything about it. It's oh, tough. no. Come on. Hey, hey, hey. This is not cool. What more do you want? What else can I fucking say here? I don't want anything from you, Woody. I want there to be a big black hole where your fat, dumb fucking ass okay. to be. Cut this shit out now. I don't care what it's about. Oh, I forgot. You haven't heard what? the news. This walking lard cake was paying Holly's sister to let him fuck her behind all of our Wait, backs. Wait, what? And Holly had to find out going through all of her sister's shit. What fun that must have been. Trick after trick of this fat ass and Lily. I didn't plan for that, all right? It's our thing, whatever it was, it wasn't a big deal. It wasn't. I never fucked her when she was snowing. I didn't know nothing about that. No, but you knew Holly would flip out. And you knew for a damn good fucking reason. All right. You know what? Fuck this. I don't need this shit. Oh, yeah, that's it. Now you're teary-eyed. You were always such a low life. I don't know why I never realized it till now. What do you think about this fucking loser, Sheriff? He can think whatever he wants. I don't give a shit. No, that's okay, because I'll tell you what he thinks. He thinks you have to pay chicks to touch your fat I do have questions, ass. though. That's what he thinks. Wait, wait. I've got some questions for you. What possible questions could you have for this piece of shit? Everything's a problem when I want to talk, but when the woodsman's about to leave, it's, oh, wait, I have questions. This. Do you know something? When you saw Lily... Did she ever mention anything about a witch? No. We didn't talk about work. All right. Well, I get one question, and that's it. Okay. <laughs> Great. Haha. <laughs> Perfect. Wasted Man. it. I don't know where Lily's shit is. <sighs> Check Holly's room. I don't know. But I wouldn't wake her if I were you. Sleepwalkers and trolls. I think that's the role. Maybe, uh, ogres, too. Thanks for that. Actually, Big B, if you'll excuse me, it seems that I'm Don't pass, pass on out. the broken glass. What a day. Am I right, Sheriff? What a fucking day. Gren won't remember this. <laughs> that's pretty funny. Wait, I hope that's a good won't remember this. Oh, this could be bad. Well, she won't wake up, right? All right, we won't wake her up. Hmm. We're not gonna examine the creative. Well, let's examine it. Fine. Why'd you do that for? That's not examining. I'm not gonna touch Holly. Ew. Okay, um... 
Oh, no. Oh, good. I didn't even have to do anything. Look at that. Of course, there's a bottle in it that can make noise. So glad that that's there. Well, wow, there's not much there, but there is that glamour. <sighs> that you, Woody? <sighs> Woody, is that you? Yeah, sure. Woody, bar's closed. And Lily ain't around anyway, so you can run off back to the woods. I Thanks. Guess. Go to sleep. Cool. Goodbye. Who? Hey, there's Tweedle. Tweedledee or Tweedledum in the background. Did you care about her at all? She was a nice girl. Ran around too much. But All right. nice girl. I'm not the woodsman, Holly. It's the sheriff. It's Big B. Mm. Mm. Big B? Bar's <laughs> closed. And excuse me, but I'm not in the mood for entertaining. But what the fuck? I know you're not gonna leave. You do what you want. You always do what you want. That takes all the fun out of it. All right, then. So, well, we got the book. At least I have her blessing, though. Let's examine the brooch. Interesting. Hmm. Why do you even come here? There's nothing here to investigate. I can't be any use to you. I'm just... I'm tracking a lead. Huh. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, that's right. I am. Uh, we'll look at the glamour tube first. Very useful. I'm glad I checked it out. It told me so many things. see. All the answers must lie in this little book. Address? Come on. Be honest, Sheriff. Why are you going after him? The guy that killed Lily. You could have quit a long time ago, but you're still going. Why? Did they give you this job for a reason? Or was this the only thing the business office would let you do? The guy I think did it? He and I have a history. A schoolyard grudge ain't a reason, Big B. At least it ain't a good one. You just remember, whatever bullshit excuse you tell yourself, I'm counting on you. So I don't have any more fuck What do you mean, any more fuck-ups? I haven't had any fuck-ups yet. Not any major ones. Come on! If you were getting your glamour on this day, then one of these... Ah, oh, shit. Don't make me choose. Anti yeah. Leaf. That's it. Gotcha. Hello, this is Snow White calling. I'm looking for Big B. Wow, they have an answering machine. That's cool. Bigby, if you're there, pick up, okay? Pick up. Bigby, pick up. Snow? Oh, thank God. Tell me I did. Something. I got it, Snow. Her address was here with Lily's things. It's on uh, White Plains Avenue, 1284. It's an apartment complex. Great. Let's go. Let's get going. All right, let's go. I don't want to miss him. I'll meet you there. All right, I'll see you there. Let Snow do her own thing. Let her be independent. 